welcome back to day 11 of Jenny's Countdown to Christmas. My name is Chris O'Neill. I'm so glad you're here. I can't wait to open the next gift. All right, so let's grab it here. I'm so excited about this because I have no idea. Now you guys had some great, great guesses in the comments yesterday. Someone said a pressing pad. I thought that was a great guess. A lot of people, or a few people I should say, said panels, like a fabric panel that could be folded up. Somebody said bolzel foam, and it does kind of feel like that. So let's open it up and find out. Well, oh my goodness. It's a, it's felt birds. Look at, that is so cute. It looked, it's a kit. It has, looks like they're pre-cut. Well, that's why it was so spongy. <laughs> wow, okay, let's, let's pull the pattern out and look. Oh, look at how cute. These are great. Oh my goodness, all right. I'm so gonna make these. I may have these done tomorrow, at least one. They're really, really cute. Okay, oh, I love this item. This is great. And it looks like it comes with a needle. Oh, and it comes with the embroidery floss. So I think that might be everything in here to make it. I will let you know tomorrow what happens with this. As we get closer to Christmas, I might not be, you know, great at getting them done the next day. Just fair warning, just things get busier, but I always try to get them done. So we'll see. If I don't get them done by the next day, I hope to have them done within a future video. That's my disclaimer on that. Okay, warning. I'm going to guess the next package. Here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, it's very heavy. It's a little squishy, but there's like indentations. It has a point up here. It's shaped like a house, I think. I don't know what this is. It almost, although I know it's not because it doesn't cut into me, <laughs> but it almost feels like an AccuQuilt die. It's a little too thin. And it's also, like I said, not sharp and cutting in me. I'm so excited about this. Oh, I can't wait, I can't wait, okay. All right, so we'll have to wait until tomorrow for day 12. Let's talk about the playing cards. These are so great. Where did I put them? I have them here on my table. Okay, I just wanted to show you them. They're, they're so pretty and they're nice, high quality. First of all, Chuck the Duck, look at that. He's the Joker, very cute. Uh, the cards themselves are so pretty. And then on the face cards, like the Jack, there's a quilt block, and then there's different ones on the different face cards. I, I love these. They're such high quality and beautiful. I, it, really nice cards. And if you play cards, it's great. If not, somebody even suggested it would be a great gift for a non-quilter because they're just beautiful. I completely agree. Okay, I am pricing them at $16.95. I have my reasons. First of all, I didn't know how expensive sets of cards like these are in these gift boxes, and I couldn't believe it when I started searching for it. But I did find what I think is comparable to these, which is a G's Bend deck of cards on Amazon, and they are $16.95. And that's what I'm placing this at because I think that's a really good comp for this. Let me know what you think in the comments. Also, because it's $16.95, it gets rid of that 95 cents at the end that has been driving me crazy every time I do the math. I'm a former English teacher. I don't like doing math. <laughs> so this will make it a little bit easier for me too. Win, win. All right, so that brings our grand total for everything, at least in my estimates, to $142.95. You subtract that from what I paid and we are at $37. Now I'm gonna have to look at my paperwork last year to see when we broke even, because I swear it was later in the month. I'll put that up here, you know, so we know exactly what date or what day we broke even in my estimations again, which are not scientific <laughs> and not really based on fact, just saying. So we are definitely approaching that mark. And with these, I don't know. I don't know what I'd price these at. These are really cute, this nice felt kit. I'll have to look online, see if I can find some comparisons. Anyway, I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope you take some time to sew, and I'll see you real soon. Bye.